It's 10 a.m. in New York, where we're following some breaking economic news. U.S. employers added 199,000 jobs last month, a sign that the labor market is still going strong. And the unemployment rate dropped to 3.7 percent in November. Here for more analysis is Javier David. He's the managing editor for business and markets at Axios and a CBS News contributor. I think, Anne-Marie, I'm going to let you take that first question. Glad. That's great, because Javier is indeed here with me. So we were just talking a little bit about the numbers. Uh, what, is this a good news story? What does the data say? Well, like Glassdoor put it, it's boring in the right ways. It's another <laughs> month uh, and another sort of report that shows that we're on track for a softer landing. The headline, almost 200,000 uh, jobs created last month. The unemployment rate actually fell to 3.7%. Mm. We were expecting something in the neighborhood of 185, 190K, <laughs> and then the unemployment rate of 39 but the overall story is it's a good news story, which means it's bad news for markets because the markets recently have been aggressively pricing in a scenario of weakness that mm. prompt the Fed to cut rates because inflation's been successfully corralled. So that's really the big headline. Mm -hmm. But strong payrolls uh, and an unemployment rate before 4% ain't it. Um, so just do these numbers have anything to do with people getting back to work after the strikes, like the auto worker strike? And the and That's the, a big okay. part of the story, as is where are we? De uh, December, holidays, lots of hiring. So ah. some of that is some there's some seasonal distortions going on here. And so can we take some can we take from this something about the overall health of the economy? The overall health of the economy shows that we're the soft landing scenario has been achieved. We're not mm -hmm. falling off of a cliff. There is market deceleration. You're seeing fewer and fewer new job postings, but that's because employers are able to get out of you know the market, mm -hmm. the job market, what they need. This economy has all of the jobs it needs. If you want, if you're looking for a job, you can find one. Yeah. Um, and employers have, are clearly telegraphing that they have all of the sort of needs that they have that right. require for now. Okay, so then if we are achieving the soft landing that the Fed was hoping for, what does that mean moving forward in terms of rate cuts? It means that the Fed um, is has a hawkish bias. They don't want to start cutting rates unless they are completely convinced that inflation has been tamed, whipped, done. Right. Um, they are on pause, okay. um, and pause means the balance of risks are tilted now, I think, more or less to the downside, more than they have been for the last year or so. Um, and the market is certainly telling us, um, and the price of oil is actually quite interesting because oil has been telegraphing that it's concerned about China, it's concerned about demand weakness, mm. um, and that suggests uh, slowing, if not uh, an outright recession. So Interesting. Uh, Javier, always great having you here. Thank you. Thank you. Have a good weekend, by the way.